Firefly? Wait. Wait, that's Robin. That's Robin. There are there there's all sorts of stuff. Who is this? Wait, who is this? The family cannot allow guests to enter a dream while bearing burdens. What? He's got wigs oh, coming out of his head. Devil, look who's here. It's, it's Sunday, Sunday and Robin. The most handsome man in Panacone. Along with a singer renowned across the universe, Robin. Robin. He said you were the most dashing person in Panacone. How interesting. Robin, it's me. I've kept you waiting, Mr. Aventurine. She's so pretty. This way, please. Let us speak in private. Let's go talk to me. I want to talk to Robin. Oh, wait a minute. I'm sorry, but are you the the singer at Salon Superstar? If I can stop one heart from breaking, that's your song, isn't it? I never thought a cutie like yourself would be a fan of mine. Cutie? Oh, It is an honor to meet everyone. Are you also a member of the family on Penacone like him? <laughs> Truth be told, I am a guest like everyone. Penacone is my hometown, but I left when I was older. I was graciously invited this time to return and sing a song at the Charmony Festival. The person you speak of is Sunday, my senior, and one of the local leaders at Penacone. He is also the organizer of this era's Termini Festival. He heard you all ran into some difficulties and sent me here to provide aid. Alas, I arrived a little later than usual. I sincerely apologize for any unpleasantness during your stay. Uh, please, be at ease. I have instructed Sound Ms. mixer? To Doko? Sound mixing? Please? I have also Did they know the that you should make the voices louder than the music? Please, rest assured that the family will personally undertake communications to handle this. It is only right that we, as the actual administrators, relieve you of any problems during your visit in Panacone. Wait, wait, wait. What did they mean by this? What did Sunday and Robin mean by this? By the actual administrators in Panacone? What do they mean by this? I apologize for taking up everyone's precious time. And we shan't keep you any- May your dreams be beautiful and pleasant. I'm gonna steal that one. I'm gonna use that one. May your dreams be beautiful and present and pleasant. In hindsight, there was more to that statement. He also had Miss Robin with him. I'm no singer, but her voice sounded a little strange. It does. Would a singer it did. really take to the stage if their voice wasn't in top shape? Yeah. About Robin. You know, it's weird. Well, noticed it too, about how Miss Robin's voice sounded somewhat weary. I can't quite put my finger on it. But it was different than usual. Could she be tired out from her cosmic concert tour? Insisting on performing under such circumstances. Miss Robin is a superstar among celebrities. <laughs> there is nothing to worry about. You've arrived at the dreamscape. It's beautiful. It seems like our guest here hasn't gotten used to the transition. Me neither. Fret not. Feeling a sense of weightlessness is normal for new visitors. Robin, please guide our friend in getting more comfortable with the new environment. That's me. I'm Robin. Leave it to me. Slight nod to her brother and locks her emerald gaze with yours. She smiles and you see the ripples shimmering in the depths of her lake green eyes, followed by a mighty vortex emerging from the depths of the pool. Vision dibs as your body dissolves, becoming one with the fluidity of the time space. You resonate with and become attuned to the serene fusion of frequencies. Your heart drums, leading this symphony. Don't worry, just relax. You'll be feeling like your normal self in no time. Inhale. Now exhale. They chant. Instinct compels, and the stagnant fluid in your chest begins to flow again. A gentle warmth emanates from within, saturating every inch of your being. Your melodies close down, 
fading away like a lullaby. A seven-colored illusion delicately caresses the top of your head and closes your eyes. Its movements tender and compassionate. You feel contentment and drift into a deep slumber. You open your eyes and feel a vitality like no other. The difficulty you were experiencing a moment earlier feels like a distant memory. You should be feeling fully in control now. <laughs> Welcome to Pinnacody. Welcome to Pinnacody. I merely changed your state of mind for you to feel more at ease. Now we're here. Now we're out here. Relax. Just did some tuning on you with the resonance of the harmony. Future Honkai Star Rail spoilers. It is commonly understood that the Trailblazers' next element will be the harmony element. We're beginning to see how that might unfold in the story. Sunday and Robin are talking about being tuned by the harmony. Is that how we're going to see the Trailblazer transformed into their new harmony type? Don't mind him. He's always like that. Please, enjoy the beautiful dreamscape the family has built for everyone. We shall take our leave. Have a blast. Thank you, Robin. Thanks, Robin. Singing? Where is the sound coming from? It's Robin. Somebody's singing. Somebody's singing. It's Robin. It's me. Have you heard of this song? It's called, If I Can Stop One Heart From Breaking by Robin. Her songs are played in the dreamland from time to time as the Charmony Festival is drawing close. Look, friend. The game has already begun. Ooh. Allow me to make you an offer. One you can't refuse. Firefly? Wait. Wait, that's Robin. That's Robin. To choose otherwise. Wait, that's Robin. And no other choices. Wait, that's me. I'm Robin. Wait, did they kill Robin too? To be continued? What the hell, dude? They killed Robin? They killed me in Honkai Star Rail? Rage, right? I'm mad. Brother, I'm back. Wait, she's right there though. Welcome back. How is your preparation for the performance coming? It's fine. Don't worry. It's fine? <laughs> this is not good. You're the pride of the family. And don't let those unnecessary emotions affect your perfect pitch. Get up. Back off. Okay? I... No. Brother, you seem to be in low spirit. What's happened? Is it because of the watchmaker's guest list? Yes, I received the report that death had taken some of them. Who is death? Perhaps someone was behind it. Huh? I'm sorry. I forgot you just came back. You probably wouldn't know about it. Somehow, a nightmare called death has descended upon Panacone, striking indiscriminately, bringing spiritual death to all equally. Spiritual Death. The utopian dreamscape envisioned by the family. Such sorrowful incidents shouldn't arise. It profoundly undermines the equilibrium and serenity of the dreamscape. How detestable. I can't believe this has happened. Was someone killed again? Yes. There were two. One was a stowaway. Uh, the other... Was you? was you. Oh. That's enough, fool. Your deeds have saddened me. Pretty sharp, aren't you? Chicken winged boy. Oh my god. Sparkle? Sparkle, what the fuck? Sparkle. What did you hear? Robin is going to play? Robin's gonna play? I was thinking I couldn't be any more jealous. I'm gonna play. That's what they said. The biggest singer in the universe. Yeah, I am. Scalpers must be having a field day. Oh, that's for sure. I will. I will be performing in just a in just a few moments. Moments at the Pinacony Festival. I'm Robin. You think I'd get an invite to the Charmony Festival? But no. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not Black Swan or Robin. Robin mentioned for me personally, there is nothing more important than praying for a better future. 
Which I will be doing in the VIP section of the Robin concert. The Robin concert. One thing I think this entire live stream has done really, really well is I'm very, very intrigued in this world in Pinaconi, in the family, in these performers, these different characters they mentioned. I wasn't really, really like intrigued quite yet, but now I'm intrigued. It feels like they're talking about something that I want to know what they're talking about. They have me hooked. It feels like these Pinaconi people are having a fun conversation that I'm not yet a part of. I'd like to be part of the conversation, please. I want to understand what you're talking about. I can't wait to play. As you can probably guess, Robin is absolutely dominating the charts. While Robin's albums rank number one through 120, a new edition hit the charts last night, coming in at number 121. Are Robin's chart dominating days actually going to come to an end? There I say it. I didn't even think that'd be possible. But no, I dominate the mysterious phenomenon that's been connecting all of our universes together. 